camp. I know you still got preparation ahead, but camp is officially over, yeah, I guess. That's a wrap on fall camp. It was excellent. It was, uh, we got accomplished what we needed to. I think we've progressed adequately in all areas, and we still have nine practices left. We need every one of them. But uh, through 20 practices and, and through the official and the fall camp, I think we're in a pretty good position right now. We've got to keep, keep cleaning some things up these next, uh, what, 12 days? Everything gets settled that you want to do, pecking orders and things yeah, like that? Yeah, pretty much. Pretty much. And we'll, we'll, uh, we have some live work today that we've got to evaluate, but we're pretty well settled in. Those positions like wide receiver, linebacker, that were concerns going in, have they been addressed? Mm -hmm. Yeah, they have. Uh, where are you sitting linebacker wise? Uh, we'll publish that probably Monday or Tuesday next week. Okay, but you got an idea on oh, everything, yeah. right receivers, right. the whole? Uh huh. And yeah, you feel yeah. good, optimistic about how everything came? So far. Yeah, we still have, uh, like I said, a lot of detailed things to clean up, but, but uh, relative to where we are right now, having nine practices left, I think we're pretty good shape. What did you want to see from your wide receivers this year at camp? Uh, first of all, overall, tougher, more physical mentality, which I think we've got. I mean, there was a group that uh, we think needs to, need to compete more, show more, a little more uh, intensity in the things that we're doing. We saw that all fall camp. Uh, make plays, that's the bottom line, is making plays. I think they did a nice job with that. Very few drops this camp. We're not, we're not perfect, but uh, we're much better than we were last year. But again, the real key will be how we operate uh, Thursday night first. So, yeah. From a leadership standpoint, did you guys come out of camp with somewhat of a pecking order? Oh, yeah. Yeah, defensively, it's uh, Hunter Demick, Mike Domo Hatfield, Marcus Williams, Kyle uh, Fitz, uh, low, low to the lane. J.J. Gilman, uh, Tim Patrick, uh, Troy Williams, of really course, uh, he's really embraced that role. Uh, the players, I think, respect the role. We'll announce our captains uh, to come on as well. Our team captains, the captains, the leadership council. Are, are there any young guys that you expected to maybe redshirt that you think now are, are going to play more than you expected? Julian Blackman, uh, Zach Moss, if I uh, get uh, healthy, he's still a big uh, Let's see. Mark Simpkins, so he's a true freshman as far as an over two in the spring. Um, Bradley and I, maybe the, uh, linebacker Donovan Thompson. Uh, probably two or three more I'm forgetting. There's going to be about a half a dozen. Is there any that pleasant surprise, a guy that maybe overperformed your expectations at camp? Well, when Seattle went down, that was a blow to us. But That position group, you know, with the, with the, uh, the injury that was so deflating, they, they ended up responding. Wallace Gonzalez, we, we saw him just like a week ago moving back over to the defensive side. For a day or two, yeah, because yeah, that was a log jam. It was before Seattle got hurt. It was kind of a log jam there. We had some defensive ends that were banged up. And uh, he came in and said, hey, you know what? Anything I do to help the team? You know, so we put him over there for a couple of days to take some reps because he was there. At one point, a couple of years ago, we, we experimented with the defense. Right? But he's a true tight end. That's his most natural position. And when Seattle went down, it became a no-brainer to get back over. It seems like every practice since he moved back over, uh, one coach or another has said, wow, he had a great practice he's today. Starting, he's starting to blossom. He's starting to figure it out. And uh, he's, uh, he's still a ways away. But he's come uh, a long way since uh, when he first put on the pads for us a couple of years ago. Have you figured out your kick return game yet? Yeah, we'll publish that next week as well. Yeah, we know where we're sitting. Thanks, Coach. Oh.